Yeah, Rob, we'll start with you. Uh, power creator Courtney Kemp said, quote, by deadline, uh, it's definitely in terms of its violence, referring to force, uh, very old school power. Do you agree or disagree and why? Absolutely agree. We we are definitely keeping the same roots that the original power had when it comes to sex, drugs, violence, rock and roll, all that good stuff. We're, there's no PG over here. We're coming in with all of it. <laughs> uh, I respect that. <laughs> and, and and Shane, you know, I, I was I was watching your character and the layers in your body movement besides the tech is something to behold. I know there's a lot of things going on with Vic. How would you sum up this character as the uninitiated? Yeah, no, I, I, I appreciate that. Um, yeah, it, it is all it is all in the movement, especially for me when I'm like kind of prepping for a role and like you put on that that you know all that the, the coat the coats and the and the swag all kind of comes out, you know. I mean, <laughs> when you put on Tattoo. Yeah, when you, when I put on the neck tattoo and the Tom Ford suit, it it, it works. You know, it all kind of it all kind of comes together um, on set. But um, yeah, I mean, I love look, I love the character. I think um, it's it is a very intriguing um, first season for him, trying to find himself, trying to step you know step into the role that his dad is currently um, you know uh, occupying. And, um, and then also, you know, trying to make this relationship work that his dad doesn't approve of, you know, is it the family business? Is it the love of his life? Should he run away? You know, how committed is he to the game? Because if you're not, you're going to get, you're going to get caught. You know what I mean? You're, if you get caught, caught slipping, then it's like, you know, yeah. it's yeah. game over. So we'll see. I hope, I, I mean, I hope he, I hope he makes it through. Uh, kind of a follow-up question then. I mean, the Power franchise is pretty much established. How exactly have you gone about adding your own swag to it by keeping everything in order how Power usually is as a brand? Yeah, that's actually, man, that's a, that's a, it, it, it is a, it is a, a, a line that you don't want to, you know, you have to keep with, the brand is so strong. And if you don't want to step outside of it, you know, because if you do, then it, you're going to stand out in, in the wrong way. But you want to do your own thing with the characters because these are new characters that are, you know, that fans haven't seen and all that. And I think it really starts with with Joseph and what Joseph's doing and the tone Joseph's setting as Tommy Egan and when he rolls through and kind of we're just kind of falling in into that. And I think truly such a big presence, you know, I mean, Joseph's such a big presence and the Tommy character is so big. We just kind of have to fall into line with that and everything else works. Uh, yeah, you know, we're all guests in Tommy's world, and that's kind of the dynamic and how how we get introduced to it. Is yeah, yeah. I mean, working the bar at eleven o'clock in the morning. I mean, I hear you. That's <laughs> you Only do Tommy you is doing that. <laughs> right. Uh, so tell me more about the character of Gloria. It looks like she has some layers too, even with uh, uh, Vic's character or Shane's character as well. I and mean, what's been your approach of giving revealing some layers about Gloria, but not giving too much away in the first couple episodes? Yeah, you know, again, we have so many spoilers, but um, yes, Vic, the Vic and Gloria situation is definitely a complicated one. Um, you know, they, they 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 do want to be together ultimately, but it's just proving too difficult with the presence of Walter Flynn, who is a huge presence. And um, yeah, you know, she's, she, she's definitely a feisty one, as you see very early on. She's very determined and things get even more complicated when, you know, Tommy comes into her life. Um, who she's very welcoming of um, on this break with Vic. Um, and yeah, you know, she, she's just really trying to get out from under the Flynn family and trying to make the best out of the situation that she's, she's kind of got herself in. Yeah, thank you. Uh, unfortunately, that's my time, but thank you so much for rocking with me today. Uh, have a nice day, y'all. Thank you. Appreciate you. Have a good one.